Hey guys, Tyler with MajorLeagueSwings.com. Today we're going to take a look at Jose Batista. Just something about his swing that I, for whatever reason, have always just really liked. Um, not exactly sure what it is, but I think part of it is I was always taught keep your hands still and quiet and be quick and short and take your hands straight to the ball where Batista's the about the exact opposite. I mean, he's got a big bat tip, he's got a big leg lift, and he's got a lot going on in his swing, but he crushes baseballs, he crushes home runs, where with my swing, I wish I'd have known this back in the day because I was more of a line drive hitter, base hit hitter, couple couple doubles here, once in a while a, a home run here and there. But, so I think that's what it is. I think it was just all the movement that I just, um, just thought it was so different to, to why I liked watching him hit so much. But So let's get into it here. First thing I want to point out is he has his bat tipped. But then also look at the ball right here. Look how far the ball is to, to the catcher. And he still has the bat up. I, sorry again about the, uh, the camera angle. It's obviously not the best to cut him off a little bit here. But I think you get the general idea. His bat's still really vertical. And the ball's very getting really close to home plate. But watch as he goes here. Watch how level that bat gets. I mean, he's he's got that bat tipped, and he's turning the barrel really deep. And he's slightly up to the ball. And look how that barrel's really working hard to, to hit that ball out front. And he just launches that ball. So again, getting on path with the shoulders, getting on path with the bat. Just crushes the ball there. Okay, let's look at uh, let's look at another one. This one I really like just because of how out front he gets. But to me, that shows the power of if you're staying on plane with your shoulders and with the bat. You can hit a ball really deep, or as what you're going to see here, you can actually hit it quite a ways out front. So there's his leg kick. Again, there's his bat going back towards the dugout and back around. Now watch how out front he hits this ball. I mean, look at that. Still got a little bit of forward shoulder tilt. Kind of even, but a little bit of forward shoulder tilt. But, I mean, look at that. And then to launch the ball. That is crazy. So now let's think of this. So if he's here, right, here's what I was taught. He's here, and his hands take him down to the ball, right? So if he's doing that, how is he ever going to hit the ball out front with power, with launch angle, like he does here? So if his hands were going to go here and the ball was here, it just wouldn't happen. I mean, look at how, how level his bat is. The barrel's below his hands slightly and just gets through the ball. Does such a good job right there. All right, one more. Here he is at the uh, Home Run Derby. I believe this was in Kansas City. Okay, he's got his bat tipped, but here you can really see that bat work back. So bat tip, and here he's going to turn the barrel. I mean, look how flat it is. I mean, obviously that pitch is a little up. Home run derby, you want it up a little bit to hit the ball out a little bit easier. But still, I mean, you can see that bat. So he's just rotating his the barrel around his hands and just launches it. So again, this is how you have a little bit of an uppercut to match the plane of the pitch. So your barrel is in the in the uh, hitting zone longer. Whereas, again, where I was taught, taking these hands right down to the ball. And which, again, leads to a lot of balls down in the, in the dirt. So you're an easy out to shortstop, second base, slicing the ball. You can't hit it the opposite way as well. He just does such a good job here. I like how that bat just drops kind of in the slot and right around it. 
Got a sweet swing. I know that. All right, guys, thanks again for watching. Uh, if you want to swing like the pros, head over to my website, MajorLeagueSwings.com. And that's actually where you can send me a video and I can teach you the same movements uh, that the pros use. So lastly, uh, if you like the video, maybe I taught you a thing or two, please hit the like button and subscribe. And thanks again for watching.